Hello, welcome back to Simple or Difficult. In this video, I will show you how to change your drawing area, that's your viewport area, to any color you want. But in this particular video, we are going to be changing it to white. All right, so to do that, all you need to do is head over to your customized user interface. Okay, when you open it, you're going to see something like this. Now, before we do anything, I want us to just save this and call it um, black viewport. So we can easily switch back to it. All right, I'm gonna save it. Now, if you want to change this viewport, you just have to go down here to viewport background, viewport background, and then you click here. When you click it, this color selector comes out. So you shift it to white. All right. The next one we need to change the color because as you can see, nothing has happened is this. So you select the viewport gradient background bottom. You select it, shift it, make it white. If it's blue you want, you can change it to blue. Now this particular one, we shift it to white as well. And that's basically it. So I'm going to close this thing down. When I do, you find out that it is now white. So that's how you do it. So let me go back in there and save this one out and call it white viewport and then save. Now that I've done this, if I want, I can come here and load my black viewport in. It is going to change it to black. If I want, I will come and load my white viewport in. It is going to make it white. Okay, it's not very easy. So you can save as much color preset as you want out so that anytime you want to just quickly do something with the different colors, you can easily access them from there. All right. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a like. And if you're new to this channel, this is the first video you are watching. Consider subscribing. Okay. I draw videos like this, even full courses and then review tutorials, all kinds of tutorials on this channel. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of these future tutorials. Thank you very much for watching this video. I will see you in the next one.